terrified. The Witcher's contact in Velen was to be ended. The Emperor's spy. Hendrik was operating incognito in that war ravaged land. His mission to gather intelligence about Ciri. Yet Geralt arrived too late. The wild hunt had reached Hendrik first. The Witcher learned nothing from the spy's corpse, but the wraiths had failed to find his notes. Geralt read them and knew that Ciri had been a guest of the Bloody Baron, a local warlord. And that she'd quarreled with a witch. When she was a babe, my daughter loved animals. Saw a deer trophy on a wall once. Do you know what she asked? Haven't got a clue. Papa, is that deer's wump on the other side of the wall? <laughs> You see it there? Oh, oh, what's a trophy? <laughs> I pity any bastard who's hurt her. I'll fly him alive. Here it is. Damn it! Jammed again. Bed chamber. Tamara's room is there. Try not to make a mess. For their return, I want everything to be as they left it. What's the Panthers? Expects them to return any minute. Takes hope. Wooden candlestick. Stems broken. a different color something used to hang here hmm that painting right size the baron and his wife <laughs> look happy enough what's this ah, gotta wonder who wanted to hide the hole and what's on the other side? Hmm, it gets interesting. Piece of wood looks like the stem of that candlestick. No coincidence there. Hmm, fight might have happened here. I'll look for clues. of the candlestick and wine stains somebody smashed a bottle from Toussaint yeah Gervalus scent hasn't died wonder where it'll lead me give me a second off Couldn't find something spruce else, wood smells of juniper incense some sort of folk talisman protective question is against what won't find much else here done 
poking around. Recognize this amulet? Hmm. Yes. Anna began wearing it a time ago. Any idea where she got it? None. Any witches or cunning women in the area? A Pella. Old Coop lives near Blackbow. And there's a cunning woman in Midcops, but I know little about her. She's only recently arrived. If Anna were to see someone, she'd choose the Pella, not the woman. Anna was wary of strangers, newcomers. Ought to have a chat with this Pella. Fair warning, he's a hard man to talk to. Rumor has it he killed his own father with an axe as a lad, then went batty. Now they say he sees ghosts and plows his goat. Not really interested in his hobbies, just want to ask about the amulet. Roach, go to the Pella. We go. She's gone crazy. Move it. You've got eyes like a cat. Get Greetings. Home. Salutations. Whither do you come from, and where will you go? Hard to say. Seen a lot of the world and plan to see more. As have I, as do I. Take a peek if you don't mind. I'll bleed him dry, I do. Will, will. Buy that back. Not the best place for a traveling peddler. Profits lie amidst risk. True, the wars brought strife and hardship, but folk live on. And where there is life, there is trade. Prepared to risk your life for a bit of coin? Coin, my friend, is of little import. Hard as I try, I simply cannot remain still. So I wander and wander the world. I see new places, speak with folk I've never known. It's what I like, and that's worth the risk. Farewell. We'll meet again. I know this. Well, I do hope not. I do hope not. How do I do this? Do I need to have like a dude doing it? There's no one here.
Yo, fix my shit. Wake up! We meditate. How do I meditate? You know what? I'm gonna fucking pillar this place. There's nothing here. Bitch. <laughs> Take that, bitch. Stop sleeping. Alright, seriously though, how do I meditate? I've seen all this already. He's gonna be shocked! Hey, bitch. Yeah? Craft special order weapons too? Do politicians murder high-class prostitutes? This diagram. Think you can forge the weapon? So long. Yeah. This diagram. Think you can forge the weapon? I should start uh, dismantling shit. Like, keep uh, certain stuff. Fuck, I don't need these.
I don't know how to do this, but I've done it. So long. What do you want? Want to talk to the Peller? Too late. We've got dibs on a chat with him. A long one. Get the hell out. Now. <laughs> and here I thought we'd have a day without corpses. Herb Majors pay top coin for the special bits of rare creatures. Wonder how much we'll get for his eyes. Anybody home? Open up, it's safe now. Devils, who do they bring? What seek ye? I need your help. Whoa, a man, nay, a wolf, grey, though not old. Tis he the pillar awaits. Wood, strong smell of juniper, designed to protect someone. Freshly cut spruce sprinkled with goat's blood, then tempered with an incense of earth smoke and juniper. For Anna, to protect her. So, designed to protect her, from what? Oh, the dear. Besieged she was, evil all around, wanting to possess her. Old magic born of oblivion, from dark sources emerged. Old magic? Can you be more specific? It is not for mouth speech, nor for the touch. A small protective charm, not a thing more a Pella could do. Anna and her daughter are missing. Know where they are? Nay, no, nay. Pella don't know. But the spirits could know. The Pella will auger, the spirits ask. Spirits? Great. Fine with me. As long as I know where to look, where to find them. Lost, lost, must be found. Princess! None better than princess for finding things. Princess? Which princess? He's gone nuts! Princess, my goat! She's fled! Oh. No 
Ryoku's men must have scared her off. Can we get back to the auguring? Without the goat? Impossible. No goat? <laughs> Won't work. <sighs> Will you help me if I bring the goat back? Princess! Princess! Where have you got to, girl? Fine. I'll get your goat. The bell! The little bell's ringing! She loves it! Ring, ring, and she will follow! But for a while. But beware of wild strawberries! Raspberries, too! Yeah, treacherous as beasts go. I always keep an eye out for them. There you are. Let's go see the beller. Come on, take you back to the beller. Misses you something awful. Should have guessed as much. What's a witcher compared to a patch of wild strawberries? Come on, damn it. Do I really have to keep ringing this bell for you to follow? Is that a fucking bear? Where the hell did you go? Fuck's sake. <laughs> like, like, you know, do, do, like, little, little, little. What's in here?
Do I really have to keep ringing this bell for you to follow? You're no roach, but I bet we could be friends in time. You've got that all-important quality every roach has to have. You don't talk much. Here's your fucking goat. Flee not from the pillar for there are wolves about. Goat of mine, dearest, sweetest goat. Can we talk about Anna and Tamara now? Know where they might be? Blood. We need blood. A living being. Fine. Be right back. Just kill your fucking goat. Will this do? Mentioned a child. Whose? Why, Anna's. Anna was pregnant? She was. And she miscarried. Hmm. Baron didn't mention it. Afraid, perhaps. Or ashamed, or forgetful. Or perhaps he had no wish to remember. Did the Baron have anything to do with his wife's miscarriage? Foul tempered he is, and he's a fondness for hooch. No doubt makes his temper even fouler. Did he abuse his family? Anna came to you, you must have noticed something. The Pella's old, near blind. But Princess came and licked her hand. So what? She's a wise beast. Only comes to those who suffer. What happened to the child? In a grave throne. Without rite or ceremony, it awoke. Now it wanders. It seeks vengeance. A botchling. White wolf, wise wolf, catch the botchling. The botchling will help lead the wolf to the loved ones. Botchlings suck the blood of pregnant women and eat their fetuses. They don't help. Tis a being cursed, and witches lift curses. If the white wolf can't lift it, he should bring me its blood. Blood will always find kindred blood. Whatever I do, I gotta find the botchling first. Seek it at midnight, near the grave that lies empty. If what you say is true, the Baron ought to know where that grave is. Yeah. 
Take it easy. Lightning strike. Why is it burning? He's gone mad! Fire. Everyone's gone mad! To the stable. What? Fire. You blind? Nobody willing to put it out? Ain't that simple. Most are afraid. Baron flies into a rage. He takes no prisoners. My brother's in the stable. We've got to save him. He'll burn alive. Him and the horses. Somebody ought to see to the Baron before he burns the castle down. <laughs> Fuck your brother, like, uh, he can't get out himself. You're gone. You, you, where do I know you from, eh? Ah, right, the Witcher. Come, drink with me. Pale as a ghost, you are. I know your wife miscarried. Was that before or after you beat her to a pulp? Fuck are you suggesting? Don't play me for a fool. You'd been beating him for years. Finally, they'd had enough and fled. Sound about right? Ah! They ran from you, didn't they? Lying sick! Shut up. Nice transition. Sit down. You beat them. I never laid a finger on Tamara. Not once. And on Anna. That's another story. She always knew how to spark my ire. You knew they had run away from the start. Yes, I knew. Why didn't you tell me? Wasted my time. Say I had. Say I'd said I had troubles. Couldn't control my wife, my daughter. What kind of flaccid prick would you take me for? Gotta admit, I do think you're a prick. Not because you couldn't control them, but because you drove them away. What? Don't play the idiot. You gave them no choice. Anna and I... It wasn't as it seemed. Seems. Don't much care what you have to say. I'm supposed to be a family, and I will, with your dead baby's help. What? How are you? How? Sometimes miscarried fetuses, if they don't get a proper burial, turn into botchlings. Into fucking what? 
Details you don't need to know. There's a bond of blood between this creature and your wife and daughter. I can use that bond to find them. I'm okay. How? One of two ways. Legends are you sure? bury a botchling under the family's threshold, perform a ritual and turn it into a lubberkin. That's a sort of, uh, hob. A guardian spirit that could lead me to your family. And the other way? We kill it and draw some blood. Take that to the Peller and he does the rest. Do not kill my child. No idea. Enough already. I never if watched the first one. I finally rest in peace. Whatever we do, we gotta find the botchling first. I'll show you where I buried her. And I'll dig the grave at my threshold. If it turns out we can't transform the botchling into a lubberkin, they can bury us in it. And the Didn't idea. look that great to me. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight at midnight. Then wait here with me. Near midnight, I'll take you to where I buried her. Get word to the common folk. Ought to stay in their homes tonight and draw a line of salt outside their doors. <laughs> and try to sober up. Do I take a shovel to dig up the grave? Take it. No, we no, watched Master Chef. for that. I don't want to see. <laughs> Maybe after I play this game, uh, I watch it. A bit further. Follow me. You give the child a name. You block me if I tell you, so I'm careful. Names are powerful seals. You might be, you might be. spot damn it will you relent i'm plowing now i've done wrong she used the uh, immune tipping the she will stay on the one who i've gotten one what's that mean watch things on the prowl look It means she fought uh, against the real chef and she won. She get a pe immunity pin she can use uh, in a... When she's, uh, she might go out. Uh, six. What the fuck? Oh my god, look at this damage.
fuck am I doing wrong? All right, I hope you win. This is hard, what the fuck? It took so long just to get him halfway. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't fight it, Kappa.
Fuck's sake. Will you give the child a name? Should have saved in the second what? part. That's fucking annoying. Names are powerful the spots. Good. Pick. But. Watch them. Take him out. Keep looking. Back to the fortress. What's this? As I recall, you were the one wanted to test the old legends, change it into a lubberkin.
something fierce. Can't hold it. Calm it somehow. Oh. What do you want to do with it? Me? Nothing. This is your job. Told you, gotta bury it under the threshold. If the tales are true, by tomorrow it'll be a lubricant. From then on, it'll watch over your house and help me find your family. Chosen a name? No. So think of her. It's important. It's... it's a girl. But what Anna have named her? Thing is my daughter. Good. Now bury the body. What now? In one day's time, Dea should turn into a lubricant. 
I'll stay here and wait. You go home. I'll wait with you. Out of the question. But that's my child. And the guilt, the responsibility for all this lies with me. Time for parental impulses? It's long past. Besides, nothing else you can do here. But... No buts. Just Witcher's work left to do here. Gotta wait a day and a night for the botchling to turn into a lubberkin. That's it. Go home. And try not to drink yourself stupid again. By blood's power, I summon you. With your name, I beseech you. Hear my call and arise, Dea. Lead me to those bound to you by blood. This mission is fantastic. change in here. Clothing. They change in here. A bracelet. One of them must have dropped it. Shoe. No way a pitch burner could afford a horse. Both were here. I'm going the right way. Wants to show me something more.
Marquez. La da 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 Are you? No. Oh. All right. I'm. <sighs> right. 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 I'm here. Lee. Bracelet. Uh, One of she must have dropped it. it. They kept in there. Might be worth looking around, though. Horseshoe. No way a pitch burner could afford a horse. Clothing. They change in here. Both were here. I'm going the right way. Wants to show me something. Fucking disgusting. Actual disgusting. I'm not I'm not killing the, the, the them again.
Oh my god, did have been here a while chewed on the saddle necrophages will eat anything these days giant claws wasn't a necrophage made these marks horseshoes missing is this the animal that lost one in the smokehouse head torn clear off takes incredible strength Must have been attacked by a powerful beast. Surprised him. Hope they got away. Hmm. Trail goes on. Good thing it doesn't end here. F5. Knock knock. The fisherman's hut. Seems she wants me to take a closer look. Who's that? In the room. Go on now. What you seek here, sir? Our hut's out of the way. Woeful. We has nothing. We knows nothing. Just need information. Looking for two women, the bloody baron's wife and daughter. Not a soul have been here, sir. Sure. Not even passing through. Daughter's medium height, about 20. Her mother's thin, about 40. Seen them? That sir came at night, right, mummy? Quiet, boy. Snitch! Where'd the girl go? Your son said enough. No point in playing dumb anymore. Sorry, sir, but you don't look like one of her father's men. Because I'm not. I'm looking for Tamara and her mother. I need to know if they're alive and safe. Tamara is high. She's to my brother's place in Oxenford. But Mrs. Anna, that's another tale. Though anywhere's better than to crow's perch with a baron. Why? Cause, cause he beat her, sir. Beat Mrs. Anna, I mean. Everyone knew, but not a one lifted a finger for to stop it. 
What happened to Tamara's mother? Uh, for like this. I was awaiting in the old smokehouse with horses. Cold as hell and so dark, couldn't see past two L's in front of you. The moon had risen high, and still they hadn't come. Began to fear some demon had snatched them. But finally, they came forth, and we sets off towards the river. Suddenly, out of nowhere, a gale arose. Thought it'd tear my head off. And those damn birds, swarms of them coursing over the woods, raising the racket to make your ears bleed. Mrs. Anna screamed bent over into herself. Tamara knelt down, gripped her arms. For then I saw it. Fiery marks on her hands. What are you planning, girl? What marks? These, well, like burned on with hot iron. On the palms, inside. Burned? Like a cattle brand? Aye, though these wasn't black scars scabbed over. These hot and glowing, as if they burned with raw fire. Thanks for your help. The lady, she'll be all right in the end, won't she? I'll do what I can to see that she is. So here our paths diverge. Thank you, Dea. Go in peace. Hey there. What? Fuck you. I don't have time for you. We're on a mission. Sorry, whatever the fuck I did. Baron gets sad. He gets angry. And he's always drinking. Help me, hey, assist you. A dwarf. Need some armor.
looking for someone who can craft me some armor. Gotta be top quality. Well, I've been at it 20 years now. Mastered the craft in some respects, if I do say so myself. <laughs> you wish. Don't listen to her. She's been sore lately, snorting every chance she gets. So, what kind of armor are we talking about? Light, but durable. Can't constrain movement, and I gotta be able to get in it without anybody's help. That all? Sure it shouldn't be self-cleaning. And how about it wipe your arse after you take a shite in the bushes? <laughs> Comfortable, strong, and light will do just fine. Ought to know one thing when it comes to armor. If it's got to be durable, it can't be light. It can. Just needs the proper tools to make it. Tools like the folk of Clan Tordoroch use on Undvik. Joanna! I told you time and again to stay silent when I talk to customers. Shouldn't pester folk with those nonsense Skellige legends of yours. It ain't legend, and it ain't nonsense. My granddad would go to Undvik for his armor. Said Tordoroch folk made the best. Till last year, that is, when a giant ravaged their island. Inhabitants either ran off or died, but the forge should still be in one piece. Worth looking into. Say I find the tools. Will you craft the armor for me? <clears throat> On condition you bring the tools. But only then. These legends mention where the forge might be? Yes. North side of the isle, in a cave. Clan folk carved out a rock face to build it. Look for the tools next time I'm in Skellige. Take care now. So long. Witcher, a word, please. Believe we've not had the pleasure. They call me the sergeant. Left over from my army days, you understand. When me and Philip, meaning the Baron, served under a Temerian banner. Wanted to ask you about something. What is it? That night when the Baron ordered everyone to lock their doors, stay inside. What did you and the Baron do? Gotta ask the Baron about that. Speaking of which, know where he is. Garden. Spends a lot of time sitting there of late. Drunk? No. Don't drink, don't eat. Just sits. There you are. See the hollyhock there? The violet blooms. Brought the plants here from Nazaire. Anna had read some story. Insisted on having them. Spent hours tending to them, trimming, pruning. She was so content at that. And them, the frilly ones, were called birds of paradise in Zerikania. But Tamara called them dragons of paradise. She adored them. Damn shame I'll never learn which blooms would please Daya most. Though it's good to know her spirit's free. Got some information about your family. You've learned something? Well, let's go inside. It's a bit chilly out. Any news for me? Your daughter's in Oxenford. What the blazes? Is she all right? 
In good health, safe. Why haven't you brought her back? Never offered to do that. How do you know she's safe? You see her at least? No, but I talked to the man who helped her escape and then took her in. Tamara is safe and sound. From what I gathered, she has no desire to see you again, no intention to return. I shan't trust some peasant dolt. I shan't trust whoever it is helped her. I need to know for certain she's safe. Go to her. You must be sure. See her yourself. I shan't believe anyone else. Nope. I've done my part. You've got done. She left for a fucking reason. You, can send. you refuse to go. Mm -hmm. Fuck you. <laughs> Yet, if you're ever in the area, by chance even, take this and just make sure she's all right. What is it? A letter of safe conduct. Ever since the Redanians took hold of the Pontar Delta, they made it damned hard to get to Novigrad without one. Very well. You were to find them both. What have Anna learned anything? Nothing yet, but I'm on her trail. Well, what are you waiting for? For you to tell me about Siri. Like we agreed. <sighs> Fine. A word once given. When Siri was on the mend, we took her out on a hunt. Thought a bit of galloping would warm up her limbs, gone stiff from so much bed rest. That lass of yours. Pure luck in the flesh. To hunt down a wild boar that size. Why, worthy of one of King Faltest's feasts, were he still among the living? Sere, come! Our haunt should be yours as I see it. Oh, you're doing well, lass. Not bad. Not bad at all. But who goes boar hunting with a sword? No bow at hand, no spear. My sword was all I had. <laughs> well, you brandished it beautifully. Where they teach you that, anyway? A little here, a little there. Not surprising, given you wander the world alone. Not alone no more. She's in the company now. That's right. You're a member of the company. We're drinking together, killed a wild boar as a pack, you might say. But we've no notion how you arrived here. A woman in a man's garb, razor on her back. Who exactly are you? You a mercenary? Let's say I go about my business, and when there's coin to be earned, I don't readily turn it down. Oh, I've always held with the world how it is today. Lasses ought to know how to fend for themselves. All right, all right. A woman could swing a sword, I've knowed one, but never seen a lady mount anything but a cock proper. All tipsy on horseback, nothing strange on account they bloody mount them sideways. Perhaps you'd care to wager? Think you can outrun me on an horse? <laughs> Naturally. What's the stake? Black Mare. The one in the stable. Oh, that won't do at all. What happened? You get the jitters? No. <laughs> so why not? The horse is mine. To race the Baron himself. I'd consider it an honor. <laughs> oh, that'd be a sight to be old. Would it ever? Done. But if I win, I take your sword. Agreed. I'd not drink any more this night. You'll want your head about you. We start at daybreak. Ready? As ever, first one to the tower. Man chop! Come on, Siri, don't you embarrass us! Your 
sword is mine. That'll be the day. Your wind, not woman. Worthy of the best horse. The mare is yours. Thank you. What? Another chance to win. She screamed like a mad woman. In an instant, all had forgotten the wager. Every man ran to save his skin, even were he to break his neck. And they make it? Some, aye. Others were not so fortunate. But what happened then? I must say, Witcher, seen a lot, but nothing like this. Never. Uh-oh. I know that look. You're a fast learner. You'll know the rest once you find my wife. Working on it. And making piss-poor progress. They split up. Hadn't considered that possibility before. But don't worry. I'll find Anna, too. Heard anything about there being witches in Velen? I pay no heed to peasant babbling. Common folks see witches, wizardry, devils, and who knows what the fuck else every which way they turn. So long. GG. Fuck you. And I, I'll stop here for now. It's good. That was uh, very fucking good. Impressive game. <clears throat> yep.